Welcome back. South Florida was shocked when a mother was charged with murder for drowning her nine year old autistic son. There are so many challenges facing the parents of special needs kids. They can often feel there's nowhere to turn. But as Local 10's Christina Vasquez reports, there is a special service that offers help anytime. It's called Project Lifeline, and the idea here is to connect special needs families to resources swiftly. Hello. Hello. <laughs> it is difficult when your special needs child is in crisis, explained Ingrid Morales, who says her son Michael is autistic and struggling with insomnia. There came a moment when feeling exhausted and overwhelmed, she thought, I just can't do this by myself anymore. She was at a breaking point. Enter in Project Lifeline. I went to her home and did an intake and really kind of assessed her needs. We're doing a nice art show. A sort of 911 system for the special needs community. A partnership between Friendship Circle Miami and JAFCO, Jewish Adoption and Family Care Options, explains Krizia Warren. We do have a 24-hour on-call line that is available to our families. It was an idea born from a town hall held in the wake of the 2020 Ripley tragedy. Patricia Ripley is facing several charges to include murder accused of drowning her nine-year-old autistic son in a canal. There was just so much discussion from parents, from providers, members of the community that there really just needs to be a place to call where parents can know that I have somebody to turn to. Lifeline was just that for Ingrid. Todo cambio. <laughs> Everything changed, she said. Enrichment programs for Michael bring him joy while giving her the breather she so desperately needed. Her message to other parents who may be struggling is Siempre hay esperanza. There's always hope. The biggest takeaway is for them to know that they're not alone. To them to know that there are people here to help, to support. As a single working mother, Ingrid says what also gave her peace of mind was the resource of a home aid. You can learn more about Project Lifeline on our website. That's local10.com. I'm Christina Vasquez, Local 10 News.